A word about metal matches. Also known as ferro rods, or erroneously flint, metal matches are a relatively recent addition to wilderness fire starting options, even though ferrocerium has been around for over 100 years. They become widely available in numerous configurations. Ferro rods have the advantage of working when they are wet, and one rod can light many, many fires. They work by producing a large number of very hot sparks using very little friction. Although most rods come with a striker, the easiest spark producing method is often to use the back of a fixed blade knife. Make sure the knife being used has a square spine. To make sparks, angle the knife blade down and scrape the spine along the rod. Vary the angle until you get the sparking you need. Ferro rods have their limitations. They require a very receptive tinder to ignite. The best and most reliable metal match tinder is the Vaseline coated cotton ball. To work the cotton needs to be fluffed out. Another receptive tinder is pitchwood scrapings. The ferro rod has to be relatively close to the tinder so that sufficient sparks land on the tinder to ignite it. One mistake that often occurs is when the ferro rod is close to the tinder and the knife or striker is moved forcefully down and impacts the kindling pile. This often results in ignition failure and the need to reconstruct the pile. A better method is to pull the ferro rod up against the knife spine or perform a small push-pull so that the knife stays clear of the pile. One of the nice things about a cotton ball is that it can be lit a distance from the kindling pile and then inserted into an appropriate location once it is ignited. By leaning the kindling pile against a small diameter branch, a space is left to accept the tinder. Another method is to place the tinder next to the branch and place the kindling pile on it after the tinder is ignited. The gap provided by the branch allows enough air to reach the tinder and kindling to support ignition. Another method in using a ferro rod is to put the end of the rod against the ground immediately adjacent to the tinder. This allows a more forceful use of the striker or knife and results in a more compact and therefore hotter pool of sparks. This technique is often useful when trying to light a less receptive tinder such as tree lichen. Practice with your ferro rod and you will soon become adept at starting fires rapidly in all kinds of conditions. Thank you.